Hi YouTube. I've got a guitar synthesizer here. It's an older one, a GR50. We'll take a look at it here first. Okay, so what's this about? You see here, you plug you plug your guitar into here. There's a special cord for it. You can put headphones in here. Uh, this is just a volume, just a normal volume. This is where you set your settings. You know, you can use all these buttons here control the settings here. Memory card. You can see it's an old fashioned memory card. I, I bought this guy probably uh, mid 90s or so. <clears throat> Power button. So you can create your own settings here and save them onto a memory card here. Main thing is this this cord here. Let's see here. Here's here's the cord. You can see there. Lots of pins there. So this end would go into here, and then this end goes into the guitar. And you can see there's actually two parts to this side here. Yeah. This goes onto the unit on, on the guitar. There's a plug for that one and a plug for that one. And then that plug would go into the guitar as normal. The reason for that is you can play the th you can play the th synthesizer here, or you can play it as a normal guitar with this plug here. So we'll talk more about that in a bit here. So on the back of this thing. It's just standard MIDI in and out. There's also a through, but uh, you normally don't use that a lot. So it's in and out. But the main thing would be these three things here. See here, here's the guitar out. You can just plug your amp into there. Run a chord from here into your amp, just as you normally would. <clears throat> and then these two. These would go to the mixing board, you know, here. Just plug them into the back of your mixing board. So that's how you would get the synthesizer sounds into your your re recordings. You could plug this one too right into your mixing board, but normally you would go to an amp. Okay. Here's the uh, here's the item on on the guitar. So 
the big plugs would go into here. And then the smaller plug would go in that hole on the side. This is just a volume button. It, it, it's been a while since I've used this thing, so I'll have to read up on it. This just switches between, you could have straight guitar or straight synthesizer, and, and, or you can have both. So you could have synthesizer sounds coming through, and you could have guitar sounds. But the, the weird thing is, uh, connected to this, there, there's a pickup. Just as you would have any old pickup. So you could have these professionally installed at, at the guitar store. But back in the uh, 90s when I bought this, I just did it myself. Uh, I just followed the instructions. Uh, I think I called the store and they wanted a couple hundred bucks just to stick this thing on. And the uh, main thing is that you get these lined up in the right spot. Okay, so I just wanted to show it. And uh, let's see, just so you know what I'm talking about here with this cord. See, it's got this real thick cord. These cords back then were 80 bucks a long or more. So this just goes into here. And then this one would go into here. And then this one goes into here. Okay. So that's how you know we, we get a normal guitar sound going through this cord here. Comes out of here through here. It still runs through the through the synthesizer, but you still can use your nor your normal pickups. And then it's all one cord. You just plug this into the front of the GR50. Okay. Uh, we'll do more on it. This is just an introductory video. Okay. See ya.